Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to use this Basus Matrix HDMI switcher. It's a 2-in-1 or 1-in-2. I'll explain what this means in the video, so let's get started. I've put a link in the description where to buy this. So first thing, let me unbox this Basus HDMI switcher. It's very small, these are the instructions. It's very light and very small. As per the packaging, you do not need any power adapters. There's no external power that is required. There's a button right here at the front. And all you have to do is press on the button to switch between the different devices. So these are the ports that's on the back. It's got the input port and two output ports. So let me explain how this works. Now here's an example of a one input to two outputs. So we have the laptop as an input and it's connecting via HDMI to the input port on the Basus Matrix switcher. And we've also got two outputs. So output one has the projector and output two has the monitor. In this case, you can basically switch between the two and you can only switch to one output at a time. Since the Basus is a switcher, it is not a splitter, which means that you cannot display the same content coming from the laptop to both the monitor and the projector at the same time. In this example, the content that's coming from the laptop will display it on output one, which is the projector. If you press the button at the top, it will switch to output two now. So the monitor will be displaying the content that's coming from the laptop. Now here comes the confusing part you can connect two inputs to the one output. So if you had the TV connected to the input and output one has a laptop and output two has a game console, like your Switch, your X Xbox, you can actually switch between these two devices so that it displays it on the TV. If you had output one to input, what happens is the laptop content will be displayed to the TV. If you press the button at the top, you can switch it to output two. So now the game console will be displayed to the TV. Now, let me show you a real life example. I've got a computer that's connected to two monitors and it's displaying the same content in an extended screen. I've got the Basus matrix switcher here. So what I'll do now is I'll disconnect the cable that is plugged into the monitor on the left hand side and plug that directly into the HDMI switcher. So let me do that now. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to disconnect this cable that's coming from the computer to the monitor using HDMI. It's disconnected now, it's a white cable. What I'll do is I'll plug it to output one. So that's one of the output ones. And the other one that is connecting to the switch, Nintendo switch, I will plug that into output two. So here we go, connecting to output one and now output two. So that's definitely going to the switch. Here we go. So we've got the, the white cable and the black cable connecting to output one and output two. So because I've removed the cable to the monitor, I'm just gonna connect a HDMI cable from the monitor to the input port on the HDMI switcher. So you've got on the input port, it's connecting to the monitor. Output one is connecting to the computer. Output two is connecting to the Nintendo Switch. Okay, let me plug that in. And here we go. Let me press the switch button. Here we go. This is the computer now. It's displaying the content from the computer onto the monitor. I'll turn on the Nintendo Switch so now 
I should be able to switch to output 2 using the button at the front. Let me press that one more time. There we go. And voila. Now the monitor is displaying output 2, which is the Nintendo Switch. You can basically switch between the two now without plugging and unplugging any cables. This lights at the front, the LED lights at the front that shows you which input and output and the status. There we go. So now that's output one. Now output two. And that's the Nintendo Switch. But if this video helped you in any way, give it a like and subscribe to the channel.